This is a small swarm we put in a nook box. Nook being, meaning small. And uh, about a week and a half ago, and we're going to check. We're going to look and see how they're doing. And if they ha have, uh, I hope they have a queen. I'm going to let a little smoke drift across them. All right. This is a good example right here to, to, to show someone. Uh, there's two frames in here. Sometimes bees in a regular hive, in this hive in this case, bees will progress one direction. When they do, you need to take some frames out of this side and move them over toward the center. I hope I verbally explain that. In this case, I'm going to show you what I'm going to do. There's only two frames in here in this nook. And uh, <clears throat> I hope you can see, I think you can, you can see the cone on the left side of that left frame. And so I'm going to try to correct that right now. Now, on the, on the right side of this right frame, they're not over here at all. So, I'm going to take this frame out and see if I see any eggs. My, my sunlight. Now, it's been about a week and a half and I do not see any eggs or larvae. All right, let's take the next frame out. All right, I'm looking for eggs first, and then if I don't see any, then I'll look for, I'm also looking for a queen, but I don't, I do not see any eggs. Okay. Can you see the comb that they built on this side over here? So they were progressing to your left. Now, I'm on, I'm on, I'm going to cut this piece of comb out right here. And shake the bees off of it. Oh, I see eggs. Woo! Thank you, Lord. Yeah. Okay. This is... Oh, there's nectar in there. I'm surprised. All right. This is virgin wax. That's just a, a miracle how they can draw those six-sided figures so perfect. Well, there were, there were eggs in there. All right. So we got a queen. I, 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 I thought maybe I was rushing it looking for a queen. But, all right, now. Now here's, I dropped that comb, comb in there. All right, now. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take this frame right here out and move it over there. Temporarily that, that will kind of solve that problem. But now I didn't I didn't see the queen. Uh, uh, most likely she was a virgin queen and made it and just started laying. Now I'm looking for her now since I saw eggs. And these bees are kind of, uh, they got a fair amount of yellow on them. And your Italian bees are the, are the yellow. Uh, I reckon I always favor the Italians. So, right now I'm looking for the queen. I, I haven't spotted her. So, 
I'm gonna put them. I'm gonna put them back in here. Put the top back on it. Maybe that little. Maybe that little bit helped you. Because bees can, they can, they can progress toward one side of the hive, and when they do that, then then you need to and and can correct that. One, two, three, go. Man, it's hot today. Hey, I was on the airplane the other day, and sitting in front of me was a lawyer, and beside the lawyer was a blonde. And uh, that lawyer kept bugging that uh, blonde to play a game, intelligent game, and uh, help pass the time away. She didn't want to, but... He told her, he said, I'll give you 50 to 1 odds. Every time you can't answer my question, you give me $5. Every time I can't answer your question, I'll give you $50. She thought, well, that sounds like pretty good odds. So the lawyer started off, he said, uh, how far is it between Earth and Mars? Blonde reached in her purse, got five dollars, gave it to the lawyer. And then the, the blonde asked the lawyer, he said, What goes up a hill with three legs and comes back down the hill with four legs? Well, that lawyer, he thought and thought. He went online. He couldn't find the answer. He gave her fifty dollars. She, she didn't say a word, didn't say anything. The lawyer said, well, come on, tell me what the answer is. She reached in her purse and got $5 and gave to him. <laughs> you got to love it.